Yeah, I mean, you know, just uh, feel alive. You know, this is your first. I'm alive. This is your first shot, your first video in uh, a while. I know, ten years. It should be great, you know. <laughs> <laughs> right, right, all right. Now let's stop this. Hey guys! Oh my goodness, it's been so long. Some of you guys are probably like, did I even subscribe to this channel? Um, but I wanted to come back because I feel like something has been missing in my life, and I've been going through a lot these past two years, and I really want to, you know, make sure that I come back and and share some of the things I've been through in terms of my journey. Um, for some of you who've been subscribed for a long time, you know that my journey is not just about my hair. It's about, you know, self-love and getting to know who I am and the natural me. Um, so I've been doing a lot of thinking and I decided that I need to completely rebrand my channel and rebrand everything and, and focus a lot on delivering a specific type of message and a specific type of brand to you all. So. Um, what I've been working on the past two years is uh, basically saving up to give you guys some quality videos. Um, the reason why I came off of YouTube, there's, well, there's a lot of reasons why I got off of YouTube. But the main reason was that some of the natural hair gurus that we look up to, and I'm not going to name anyone, but it just turned into um, more so commercialized. And I knew that my channel was more so about understanding my natural self you know, in conjunction with understanding my natural hair. And it was a lot more of, you know, quick to do uh, tutorials, quick styles. Um, I was in college when I started this channel, so I didn't have time to do all these, you know, extravagant hairstyles. So it's very much focused on just quick things that I can do um, and still keep my hair looking great and feeling great about myself. So when I saw a lot of these channels be more so focused on Try this product, try that product, you know, not to say that products are, are bad, but it just seemed a lot more co commercialized to me. So I took a little break from YouTube, and by little, I mean two years. Yes, it's been two years. Um, but during those two years, I found myself, I've learned more about my hair, um, and I've also decided to uh, invest a lot more in my channels. I know that I have a lot of subscribers, and I love you guys for your support. Even during those two years, I got new subscribers, people asked me questions. I was still active on YouTube. I just didn't necessarily post any new videos. So I decided about, I want to say a year ago, that I was going to invest in the quality of my channel. So I've been saving and I got myself a new iMac so I can have a great editing software. I also bought myself a brand new camcorder as well so I can stop using my webcam um, and really give you guys some quality videos so when I am doing hair tutorials, you're able to see um, the texture of my hair, I can zoom in and do a lot of these technical things. So, um, in a nutshell, I've just been working to give you guys really good product. Um, in the meantime of, you know, saving financially to be able to give you this good product, I've also had a lot of changes in my life as well. A lot of new things that I've um, become very fond of one of which is arts and culture and a lot of that has to do with my boyfriend um i fell in love with his art and i fell in love with his passion for art and a lot of it reminded me of my movement um for self-love and getting lost in his different abstract paintings you know reminded me of how the passion that i felt about the natural hair movement and loving yourself and and how you are and how god made you so I decided that this channel is going to have an arts and culture component um, to it, so you can look forward to that. I'm going to be doing a lot of collaboration videos where basically I bring on some new artists um, and have them talk about their movement, have them talk about what their art means to them. And of course, I'll share all of their you know social media links and websites and how you can purchase their art if you do like any of them. So that'll be a new thing to my channel is bringing in a lot of arts and a lot of these artists are part of the natural hair community as well. So it'll be great to kind of see both perspectives. So that's something to look forward to. Um, some things to look forward to would be definitely some new hair tutorials. As you guys can see, my hair has 
um, gotten a lot longer from the last time that I posted a video, but there are some challenges. I mean, there's always challenges uh, with natural hair, so I'll definitely be talking about that as well. Um, but when it comes to some of the new content to look forward to on my channel, I do want to do a lot more of the collaboration, as I mentioned. I definitely want to talk more about the natural hair community and about certain things that we think we should be doing, but we really shouldn't be doing. I've learned a lot um, from the free-forming movement in terms of you know your natural hair and kind of letting it do its thing and not manipulating it as much as we tend to do. Um, so I'll be talking about that as well, and I would love to hear your comments on that. Um, I've also looked at um, a lot of new kind of things that are going on in the style community. So when it comes to the banding method and flexi rods and all these different types of things. So I'll be doing some reviews on those as well. So you guys can see what that looks like on my texture hair. Um, so when you would like to try something, you'll be able to kind of see what it would look like. Uh, some of you I've messaged individually, thanking you for your support. Those that I have messaged directly doesn't mean that I don't love you or that I'm not, you know, super happy that you're supporting me. It's just that there are a lot of you, so I was just kind of cherry picking and then throwing, you know, some messages out there. Basically letting you all know that I'm coming back with some brand new content and I want you guys to continue to be a part of my family and continue to be a part of my community. And I would love to get some feedback on some videos that you guys are looking to see. Cause a lot of, you know, being on YouTube and sharing with you guys my story is, you know, being able to be a part of your story as well. I find that really important. So I would love if you guys can leave some comments below and let me know kind of what videos you're looking to see from me. Um, and I'll definitely be able to answer back and let you know a time frame for that video or you know if it's possible or whatever the case might be but I'm going to be officially coming back next month February 2016 is going to be my comeback month so make sure that you follow me on all my social media uh, channels so you can kind of keep up with some new things that I'm doing um, so everything is going to be Cleo Natchez, which is my brand name. So I have a Twitter account. You'll be able to see that in the description box below. Um, I also have a Facebook, uh, an Instagram, and I have a website as well where you can find everything under one roof. Um, and one really cool thing that I'm adding this year kind of to my portfolio is a blog. So on this blog is going to be basically the videos that I do here, but more so um, focus on some of those other topics that we we're talking about like freeforming or just like certain debates that are going on in the natural hair community where we all can come together and talk and share different articles and share different opinions um, and that's something that's going to be coming in March 2016 where it'll be active um, meaning that I'll be posting blogs twice a week so you guys can be able to get some fresh content there's going to be a lot of different parts of the blog fashion of course is going to be included makeup um you know different natural hair events all in all i wanted to come to you guys and just let you know that i'm back and that this is definitely what i want to do i felt that something has been missing in my life and um, i miss the interaction with you guys on youtube i miss being able to you know, spread the self-love movement, and that's 100% what I want to do. So I'm so happy that I'm back online. If you guys have any questions or you need any help with anything, the email address is still the same. It's naturallady509 at gmail.com. Again, that'll be in the description box. You can find everything there. Um, please, please, please email me any questions, any help that you need with anything, or of course, recommendations on videos. Leave that in the comment box below. Um, but until then, I'll see you guys soon. Bye.